Okay, in this example, I'm going to graph two periods of y equals 4 times sine of 1 half x minus pi over 4. The first thing I'm going to do is make the coefficient on the x in the parentheses equal to a positive 1. So I'm basically going to factor out its coefficient. Well, 1 half times x will be 1 half x. I guess 1 half multiplied by pi over 2 would give us pi over the... Well, I should say 1 half times negative pi over 2 will give us negative pi over 4. All right, so the amplitude is going to be the absolute value of 4, which is just 4. The period is going to be 2 pi over the absolute value of b. Well, that's the whole reason why we factor that out. Or I guess that's part of the reason. Well, the absolute value of 1 half is just 1 half, and that'll give us 4 pi. 2 pi divided by a half will be 4 pi. To get the increments on the x-axis, I take the period and divide it into four equal pieces, and that'll give us exactly pi. If we think about the graph of four times sine of one-half x, if we compare the new graph that we're going to come up with, we've got this negative pi over two inside the parentheses. This tells us the phase shift, or the horizontal shift, and I see a negative pi over 2. It's going to shift it in the positive direction. It's going to shift it to the right pi over 2 units. So the first thing I'm going to do is graph y equals 4 times sine of 1 half x, and then I'm just going to shift it to the right pi over 2 units. Okay, so we said the increments are in terms of pi. So let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, there's our amplitude, negative 1, 2, 3, negative 1, 2, 3, 4, so down here at negative 4. Again, um, I'm going to count over 3, and again, I'm going to pretend that's pi, 1, 2, 3. So the, the, the scale on the x-axis and the scale on the y-axis is not exactly the same, but pretty close here. And again, there's nothing that says it has to be. As long as things are labeled correctly, that's the important part. So pi, 2 pi, 3 pi, 4 pi, um, 5 pi, we've got 6 pi, 7 pi, 8 pi. So 3 pi, 4 pi, 5 pi, 6 pi, 7 pi, 8 pi. Well, if we substitute in x equals 0, so again, we're going to graph 4 times sine of 1 half x. If you substitute in x equals 0, you'll get sine of 0, which is 0. So at 0, we're at 0. Sine normally increases, and since we have a positive number out front, it still will increase. So at pi, we're at positive 4. At 2 pi, we're back at the middle, or 0. At 3 pi, we'll be at negative 4. At 4 pi, again, back at 0. At 5 pi, we'll be at positive 4 then at 0, then at negative 4, and then back at 0. So now all we have to do is take this graph and just shift it to the right pi over 2 units. So I'm going to keep the original. There was pi, 2 pi, 3 pi, 4 pi, 5 pi, 1, 2, 3, 6 pi, 1, 2, 3, 7 pi, 1, 2, 3, 8 pi. Well, we're shifting everything over pi over 2. Well, again, we said this is a length of pi. So right in the middle would be pi over 2. So everything's going to get moved over just a little bit. So there's 1 pi over 2. And again, the increments we're using are pi. I'm still moving over pi units each time to get to my next point. Moving over pi units, right? if I move over pi units, that's the same thing as moving over 2 pi over 2. So that'll be 3 pi over 2, 5 pi over 2, 7 pi over 2, 9 pi over 2, 11 pi over 2, 13 pi over 2, we've got 15 pi over 2, and I guess we would need one more uh, That'll be 17 pi over 2. So, so again, a little cluttered. Um, but that's what happens if you try to label everything. 
now it's pretty much the same. I mean, it's the exact same shape. Everything is just moved over. So instead of being at 0, 0, it's going to be at pi over 2, comma 0. And then at 3 pi over 2, I'm going to be up here at positive 4. At 5 pi over 2, I'm going to be back at 0. At 7 pi over 2, I'm going to be at negative 4. At 9 pi over 2, I'll be back at 0. That'll be 1, period. 11 pi over 2, we're going to be sitting back up at positive 4. 13 pi over 2, we'll be back at 0. 15 pi over 2, we're going to be back at negative 4. And at 17 pi over 2, we're going to be back at 0. And there is 4 times sine of 1 half times x minus pi over 2.